Hi there, it's Julie Kinnear of the Julie Kinnear team with Keller Williams Co-Elevation Realty, and I'm in the second level of 24 Kenneth Avenue, this beauty detached in uh, the West Bend pocket of Hyde Park. Uh, you can see, I also did a video just as a reminder of the main and the exterior and the outside and all that kind of stuff. So be sure to check that out. And you know, you've got the, the great original charm and character, beautiful hardwood floors throughout. And uh, you can see it goes up to the third level and there's also a finished basement, it's a big house. Um, so here's the main family bath, all renovated in great, great condition. Shows beautifully. It's nice to have two bathrooms on this level. Um, you can see the original hardware and stuff and nice closet. So this is bedroom number two of four. Plus there is this extra bonus room. So there's like an addition off the back of the house. Um, and that's why the main floor has that mud room. And this one, of course, you have this great natural light. So imagine it would be a perfect spot for an office. Great for a kid's playroom off their bedroom. Uh, you know, a little den, sitting area, what have you. Lots of opportunities there. Uh, it's a super amazing bonus space and work from home opportunity and option. So the location is pretty extraordinary. I will tell you, you know, we're really, really just a couple blocks from the UP Express the hub, the transit hub at Bloor and Dundas Street West. And uh, and that's where you've got the, you know, the subway as well as the go. Uh, so very convenient. Obviously Bloor has great cycling lanes. There's good cycling paths around here. There's the West Rail uh, path going north south. And there's also, of course, your, you know, your re really easy access down to the Gardner, the Martin Goodman Trail, if you're a cyclist or a, or a runner. I mean, the access to High Park, obviously is spectacular and uh, you know a favorite for all the families around here. It is a very family friendly neighborhood uh, and one of the reasons is not only the junior school but also that you're in Humberside Collegiate. So I'm just showing you, I'm sure you caught on, that I'm in the primary suite. So this is like so rare in these homes, I'm just going to tell you right now. So this is all renovated, nice big vanity, Beautiful, um, you know, shower and a walk-in closet. How great is that? And the south-facing bow windows. Again, really great quality mechanics through the whole home. It is turnkey and uh, they've got a pocket door there. And I'm gonna sneak you up to the third floor. So this is lots more space up here and, uh, and I love it. It's like you're in a little birdhouse. So location, uh, keeping going. It's kind of in a neat pocket. I don't know if you know the area well, but you're kind of in the junction, literally a junction of uh, the junction. So you've got all those uh, shops and restaurants and independent stores and cool little, uh, you know, hideaways here. And I'm in this big third bedroom. Of course, you could put a, a door at the end here to make it closed off, but it's pretty cool this way. And of course, if you've got a couple of kids, they would love to hang out up here and bring their friends and a nice spot for uh, your office or their schoolwork. And then you've got a fourth little private bedroom. How great is this? Again, you're up in the treetops. It's got such a neat feel, so much natural light. It's really cool. You can maybe see that all the wiring has been done through the whole house. The drains have been done. I know it sounds boring, but it's really important when you're a homeowner. The roof is very new. The uh, air conditioning, the furnace, all the really expensive goodies have been done. So um, as a homeowner, you would appreciate those sorts of things. So getting back to being in the sort of crosshairs of so many different cool neighborhoods, we've got um, the Roncesvalles, you know, you're, you know, you're just down Dundas and, and you're into all those kind of shops and the um, restaurants and movie theater and that sort of thing. And just as an FYI, I'm walking into the lower level. So you get a nice long video, but you get all the details. So uh, this is that exit to the back in the garage. And here we are. Uh, it's good height. Uh, it's got a kind of cool feel. There's a closet right as you come down here. So there's the mudroom upstairs and the closet down here. Very convenient. And you can see how they've kind of done this neat sort of look to it. And they've created like a gym workout area as well as um, I like this barn door and it closes, it opens into the laundry and the forced air 
gas furnace. As I said, the mechanicals are amazing. Like the water pressure coming in from the street, uh, the backup, all that stuff. It's great. Anyway, uh, so here we are in the in the sort of media room, playroom, rec room. Awesome to have family night and and the kids, if uh, you know, to bring all their friends down here and hang out, or you can have hockey, you can have dog play, you can do whatever you want. Anyway, be sure to check out my other video too. Um, I'll just finish off by reminding you. So we've got Roncesvalles, Bloor West Village, the Junction, and the Junction Triangle, all within a very, you know, very, very short, very close by. So it's a really neat home and a really neat location. And everybody I know who's lived on this street has loved it.